G'day there folks, Huey here for yet another episode of Civilization 6 Rise and Fall in our Long Haul Marathon playing series, uh, playing as Russia. In the last episode we um, pretty much have decimated the uh, Protestant religion in Scythia. And uh, we've only got a couple to go, so um, I'm going to send this guy down here. Try and take some of this pressure off. Aha. Uh -huh. That's what I was after. Okay. So, let's gain sources. Now, if we can... Uh, we can do a tech boost steal, or we can steal 4,000 gold. I think we'll gain sources. Yeah, let's accept. Alright, now let's uh, chop this out. So there's our lever. Um, let's go have a look over here. Oh, Karakorum. That's the original capital of um, Mongolia. So it's just these two cities we need to, to flip. I don't think I'm going to use my debater though. Just wanted to get a view on what was going on. Alright, so the lever is done. <clears throat> um, I'm thinking we will need a granary. Most definitely. So we can get our city to grow again. Alright, well, let's hit the next turn. So we've got quite a bit of a good defensive strength on most of our cities now. So we're going to flip these two. This one's going to be a bit more difficult. Hmm. Maybe I can use another spread with my debater. <clears throat> I'm a little averse to doing that, but it may be my best option. Oh. Um, I think we got a fire close by. Wow, how exciting. Yeah, it's um pretty blustery and stormy here right now, so let's flip you. Can't put a seaside resort there, really? Appeal. Oh, because it's not flat. Oh well. Yeah, cause seaside resorts have to be... Uh, let's see. Yeah, on flat land. I forgot about that. Alrighty. Well... In that case, we've got two charges with you. I guess we come down here and do a lumber mill and uh, some fishing boats. That's all I can really do for the moment. Two spreads. Um, Is that? Oh, yeah, that's Casa. Okay. Well, you can just skip turn and let's uh, see what we can make next. So, what are you suggesting? 
Ah, we've got seven of nine housing. Ooh. Well, in that case, uh, actually, no, let's get quickly get a shrine out. And then a sewer. The housing is going to suck there for a while, but she's grown pretty quick, I must say. So close. So, so close. <clears throat> don't have a lot of room here, do you? Oh well. Um. Ah, so yeah. Our pressure's finally starting to kick in here. Which is a good thing. Okay. Oh. Yeah, no, I think I go for religious combat first. Actually, before I do that, let's get an adjacency bonus. turn. <laughs> they just got that out. Yes, I'll take this. Yes, for now. Yeah, I won't make that mistake again. Thanks for gifting us that apostle before you got to upgrade him. Then, oh, really? God damn it. Oh, you got 30 health back. Are you kidding? Well, I'd better not attack you then, because it's... Well, it'll still be a major victory. Because you didn't take... Wait a minute. Okay, so this is thanks to our... Ah, this is thanks to our um, alliance, so sure. So you, uh, yeah, proselytizer, nice. Alright, um. Oh, wait a second, hang on. In St. Petersburg, and you're down here. What? How does that work? Uh, how many partisans can you get, dude? God damn it. Alright, so you're on the oil. I'm gonna need to hit you. Can't repair the factory. So we'll have to keep going with the food market for a little while. Ah, oh, there goes another trader. God damn it. How do you get a spy in St. Petersburg and then you, you cause problems in Arkhangelsk?
Arkhangelsk, Arkhangelsk, however you say it. I'm confused. You're really being annoying. <laughs> Whoever that is. Uh, oh well. Okay, so you're running away. So you decided to attack my city instead. Interesting. Uh, that's very interesting. Let's change that up again. Repair factory. Oh, where'd you run away to? Oh well. I'm going to guess and say he's moved. Wait a second. This way? Wrong. There you are. That's the end for you. <laughs> oh, I love it when a plan comes together. Alright. So, we've done the shipyard. Um, well, I guess... Wait, downtown area? No. Let's do the Military Academy, because that, that'll give us plus two science while we've got that policy active. So the next turn. Newbie has just declared war on Babylon again. Oh no. Guess who's getting denounced? Wait, I didn't see an apostle there. Or a missionary. You son of a beach. Ugh. These things are annoying.
You know, I think I'm going to move my infantry from St. Petersburg and I'm going to keep my tank army in St. Petersburg. Oh, good enough for another apostle. Lovely. Um, here will do. Denouncing Nubia. You are very naughty. Yes, denounce. Now we're going to move our navy into position. Naughty, naughty there, Nubia. Again. Just leave Babylon alone, dude. Do that. Goddamn, our museum got trashed. Let's move up there, man. Okay, well, we can send you back home to heal up. So let's do it. That's all their cities. Yep. So it's the end for Protestantism. What's this? Oh, Eastern Orthodoxy. Huh. So who's next? Who's next on the list? Um, I think the easy one's going to be uh, Mongolia, at least for now. It's only three cities. So yep, Mongolia it is. And this should be a pretty easy to flip, to be honest. Yeah, I think so. Yes, we got a boost of um, electricity. Oh, nice. <laughs> Move you in there. Am I going to keep you there? Let's get you into position. Can't quite upgrade you guys yet, unfortunately. Move you around there. Oh, protectorate war. <clears throat> uh, yeah. How many moves you got left? You can't reach yet. 
we'll just move in. Ready to ready to do it. So we've got a um, another envoy in uh, Toronto, and maybe here, ready to do your thing. Seventy-five percent are always reliable. Okay. I think. We should move you. Yeah, I might go to um, Nubia. What's your next biggest city? Maybe I won't go to Nubia. <clears throat> I think I will go. Well, how's the tech looking? 43, 45, 45, we're at 50. Excuse me, let's go to Scythia. Pavrovka. Well, potentially Pavro Pavrovka. No, that's the wrong one. Where are you? There you are. So if I go there... Yeah, that's not bad. Yep, it's going to take 15 turns, but that's fine. Okay. Here's the thing, they didn't catch us. So, the Kree have no idea we were even there. <clears throat> so we got quite a lot of funds out of them. Apache. Really? Interesting. So we cut, if we do the protector wall, we'll get um, some era score out of it as well. Which of course is always nice. Has just got more powerful. Damn it. Alright, so let's start here. So we'll go this way. And let's declare a protector at war on Nubia. Ika erbiri logo, er daimen dominem. Ai egadin, iringodo nada ken ver diken. Irony. <clears throat> As predicted, you know only how to take, and you're the one who declared war on Babylon. My god. <laughs> oh, and that forced them out of, um, the territory. Nice! Nice, nice, nice. Well, let's start with... Um, we'll start with you. Let's take you out. Oh, I 
2077. Well, <clears throat> um, I've got a chance with you. Yeah, well, I didn't after all. Okay then. best right, so we can get rid of you and then get rid of you then get rid of you Kept the same thing. All right. Let's move it back one then. Yeah, I'll put you there. Looks good. So, no warmonger penalties either. Awesome. So, we need to, um... I think I should probably head into the Cree territory next. It's pretty big. Oh, thank you. It's actually quite a large empire. So I'm going to need to bum rush them. Uh, which means I'll need to get lots of apostles before I head over there. Plan. Could do a coastal raid. That would hurt them. Hmm. We already did hurt them quite a bit. I know it on there, actually. <sighs> I think they got better vision. Nope. They don't. Uh, oh, yes, yes, they do, actually. Okay, good. still see it. And then if I move you back, or at least here, I 
Yep. there. Put you in front. Okay. That looks good to me. No missionaries. Yeah, Vegas declared war on Shaka. Okay. <laughs> Alright, folks, well, I think I'll leave it there for now. But I hope you can join me for the next episode where I hope I'm crossing my fingers that we get Broadway. But until then, folks, take it easy and bye for now.